going back again. For some reason, I might have pressed the button on my camera that stopped the video mode. You can imagine this. Most of the country's got, you know, 10 inches of snow. And it's probably close to, I don't know, 80, 75, 80 degrees today with a real nice breeze. Thanksgiving. Except for that, hopefully the noise around my mic is not too bad because I'm really covering it with my hands. So I'm hoping that helps for future videos until I can get my GoPro. That's where they rent the sailboat at over there. I think they have kayaks too, but I don't see any right now. I'm surprised nobody's here doing any fishing. I guess they're watching sports. Which is a good thing. Sometimes you can see dolphin here. This is the Clusatchee River. Not too many come up this far, but I have seen them on occasion. And, uh, looking out that way is where the golf is. This, I, I used to have a boat, so I used to be out here. But my boating days are over. a happy Thanksgiving, you know, a joyous, wonderful holiday season coming up for everybody. Um, my family lives in several different states, nobody lives down here, so I'm, I'm probably making plans, and that's the future, so I can't make anything, any promises right now, but um, I'll be going to their state and visiting them when, in time, I'm sure. Oh, look, we got ducks over here now. Oops. Bump the camera. So that's kind of cool. But, um, you know, the Corgi's Adventures are going to be real soon starting. One of my subscribers suggested that I put David, Dave, and the Corgi's RVing Adventures so it'll pull up under RV search easier. Some people said they couldn't find me, so that'll be a work in progress. And when I get a GoPro camera, then everything might be better, I promise, I hope, anyway. I am um, planning on getting a gimbal for it, so when I mount it in the RV, since I'll be by myself. Um, Chris and G has been very helpful. Chris and G's travels with positive reinforcement and hang in there. The hard part's over. I sold my house, and um, I'm hoping the corgis adjust to that lifestyle okay. And like when I would be here, if I wasn't riding the bike, if I drove my RV here, then I could be walking them right now in this beach area, and um, they could be with me. So. That's what I'm looking forward to. I'll be doing a lot more with the Corgis, Yogi, Bambi, and Pebbles, of course, respectively. So I'm going to sign off for now. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. God bless you all. And I really appreciate you guys and my subscribers. And like I said before, um, this is, um, you know, every day that goes by, I'm getting one day closer to um, giving up my brick and mortar home. Um, and that's something I'm really looking forward to so I can travel around the country. I need a camera like this guy's got, I think. That's what I need. These ducks are very friendly. They do not, they are not afraid of people. <laughs> You think they're enjoying it down here? I know one of my family members, they uh, emailed me and said they've got 12 inches of snow right now and they're buried. So, I'll take this any day.
Fort Myers, Florida area. And um, have a wonderful Thanksgiving. I've got a turkey that was given to me by my friend Linda. And it looks like it's a 20 pound turkey that I may start this afternoon and later this, later this afternoon and, and have a turkey dinner. But that's going to be more turkey than I can eat. So the corgis are going to eat well, I'm sure, tonight. I forgot to mention that um, I make my own homemade dog food for my corgis. 